All right, guys, what's up? So I got another video. Again, this one is for the parents, and this is for the parents with kids in our jiu-jitsu program. That's including our little champs and our kids' jiu-jitsu program. We're going to review some of our self-defense techniques that you can practice at home, in the grass, on some carpet, on a cushy rug, whatever you got. Okay. So the first one we're going to start with is our basic wrist grab. Okay, so I'm going to grab his wrist. He's going to, or same side, single-hand wrist grab. He's going to make sure he's in a nice strong base. He's going to make sure that back hand is up so that he can't get smacked. From there, he's going to turn his hand over and pull it to his chest and then back with his hands up. Just like that. Have him do that a few times. So grab and then you're going to do the move. Go ahead and try again. Boom. Drop to the base. Pull the hand free. Just like that. After that, have him break ball, stand up in base. So they're going to square up, put their hands on their shoulders, tuck your chin in, making sure they're not hitting their head. I'm going to touch. Boom. He's going to break ball, eyes up. And stand up the base just like that. Okay, so and do it again. All right, have them do it five to ten times. After that, have them do cover, cover, clinch, or punch block defense. So I'm coming here. I'm gonna go to hit, or I'm gonna act like I'm trying to grab him around the head. Okay, he's gonna block, block, and then go to T position. So he's controlling my arm here. His ear is to my chest. His feet are making a T with mine. Okay, from there. Try to touch them on the forehead. Make sure they're blocking this nice and strong and they're keeping their hips in and they're tight to your body. So now look, he's blocking my hand so I can't get him again. And then when you, what I like to do is pat on their back. Once I do that, he's going to drop his base, step behind, and then back away with his hands up by his face. Okay? Do each of those movements five to ten times. After that, put it all together so it'll look a lot like this. So I grab, he's going to get his base, hand up, pull his hand free. Then from there, I'm going to push. He's going to break ball. Stand up in base. Right away, I'm going to go walk, walk, T position. I want to make him touch. As soon as I pat on his back, he's going to get out from behind. And then we can do it again. So I, then I'm going to grab. He's going to break free. He's going to break ball. Boom, come up. Walk, walk, T position. He's going to cover me. Make sure I can't touch him. When I pat, he's going to step. Boom, just like that. All right, everybody try it out, practice at home, keep the kids active. Don't try to sit there and strangle them too much, even if you want to.